Hey everyone, it's Andy Zitzman, founder of the Game Time Movement, where I'm on a mission to helping you and one million other people step up your game. In this short three to five minutes every day, I'm going to provide you with inspiration, motivation, and empowering information so that you can wake up, have a little pick-me-up, get fired up so that you step up on a daily basis. So get ready, because it's time, it's your time, it's game time. Hey, what's up everyone? It's Andy Zitzman and welcome to today's show. Today, we're going to talk about three things, peace, peace wisdom, and courage. In fact, it goes in the order of peace, courage, and wisdom. And I want to share with you a prayer. Many of you may know this prayer. I learned it while I was in AA, and it's called the serenity prayer. Peace. God, grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, the courage to change the things I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. So think about that prayer for a second. First and foremost, it starts off with, Grant me the serenity. So grant me the peace to understand what this really means. And it goes into courage. It goes into courage about being, you know, having the wisdom to, or the courage to make a difference, to make a change in the things that I can control. And then the wisdom to know the difference between those things I can control and those things I can't. And guess what? Most of life, we don't control. We control ourselves. We control our actions, we control our thoughts, and we can control our reactions to situations. But but most of the stuff that actually happens to us, we cannot control. And I struggled with this for such a long time in my life. I didn't even learn this until 33, until like a light bulb went on and was like, oh my, I am spending so much time playing a victim, trying to change other people, wondering why the world isn't treating me the way that I wanted them to treat, wondering why people don't act the way that I do, wondering why, you know, wondering why basically, you know, all these things that are, that are wrong in the world and that were happening to me, you know, playing the victim and wondering why, 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 why. And just, you know, it didn't serve me at all. And spending time in that place is just a waste of time. And so, Ask yourself, what are you worried about right now that you can't control? What are you obsessing about trying to fix that you ultimately cannot control? And are there things that are just taking up your time, whether it's real time, meaning your watch, or time and space in your mind, in your heart, in your thoughts, in your feelings, each and every day that you can't control? And repeat this prayer. God Grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change, the courage to change the things I can, and the wisdom to know the difference. Life becomes peaceful when we accept the things we cannot change. Life becomes more meaningful and purposeful when we have the courage to change the things we can and we feel really darn good about ourselves and everyone else around us when we have the wisdom to know the difference. So be a champion today. Control what you can, let go of what you can't, and have the wisdom to know the difference. Hey, thanks for tuning in today, and thanks for stepping up your game. Here's what you can do to spread the movement. Go to GameTimeMovement.com and be sure to share your Game Time Moment of the Day, your GMOTD, so that others will feel compelled to share their Game Time Moments too. And if you haven't already, subscribe on iTunes or Stitcher Radio and please be so kind to leave a rating and review so that we can reach 1 million people and encourage them to step up their game too. This is Andy Zitzman. Reminding you, it's your time, it's game time, till next time.